Are your games lagging even with a good internet connection? The issue might not be your ISP. It's often Windows mismanaging your network traffic. In this video, we'll show you how to reduce ping and latency using Windows QoS settings, registry tweaks, and network priority hacks. These are real, effective methods used by competitive gamers and optimized network setups. No sketchy software, just real tweaks with real gains. Let's start optimizing your connection right now. Set game traffic priority with group policy, QoS Packet Scheduler. This tweak enables Windows to tag outgoing network packets from your game with a high priority flag. It's especially effective on local networks using gaming routers or managed switches, and it helps ensure your game data gets processed ahead of background tasks like cloud syncing, updates, or telemetry services. How to do it? Open Local Group Policy Editor. Press Win plus R, type gpedit.msc, then press Enter. Note, not available on Windows Home Editions unless you manually enable group policy or use a script to access it. Navigate to Computer Configuration, Windows Settings, Policy-Based QoS. Right-click on Policy-Based QoS. Create new policy. Policy name. Give it a clear name like Game Traffic Boost or the name of your game. Specify DSCP value. Set the DSCP, Differentiated Services Code Point, value to 46. This marks the traffic as expedited forwarding, which is high priority across many routers and switches. Select only applications with this executable name. Enter the executable name of your game, such as valorant.exe, ports, Optional, but recommended for fine-tuning. Leave as default to apply to all traffic from the game, or specify known UDP slash TCP ports used by your game, like Valorant uses UDP 7000 to 8000 range. Finish the wizard and apply the policy. Disable large send offload and interrupt moderation. These network card NIC features are designed for bandwidth efficiency, not real-time responsiveness. Disabling them reduces latency by stopping the system from batching packets or delaying interrupts, both of which can add jitter or inconsistent input during gameplay. How to? Open Device Manager. Press Win plus X, then choose Device Manager. You can also type it into the Start menu if needed. Locate your network adapter. Expand the network adapter section. Right-click your active Ethernet or Wi-Fi adapter, whichever you're using. Select Properties. Switch to the Advanced tab. This is where hardware-level NIC features can be configured. It varies slightly by brand, Intel, Realtek, Killer, or Broadcom, but most will include the same core options. Disable these options. Large Send Offload version 2, IPv4, to Disabled. Prevents TCP data from being buffered into large packets, which adds delay. Large Send Offload version 2, IPv6, Disabled. The same logic as above, but for IPv6-based traffic. Interrupt Moderation to Disabled. This feature groups interrupts to reduce CPU load, but causes input lag spikes. Enable this option. Receive Side Scaling, RSS, to Enabled. Allows multi-core CPUs to process incoming packets in parallel, reducing latency under load. Optional, but recommended. Speed and Duplex, to set to auto negotiation or your maximum supported value, such as 1.00 gigabits per second full duplex if using Ethernet. Do not set it to 10 megabits or half duplex. That can throttle your connection and create packet collisions. Registry tweaks to prioritize game networking. These hidden registry level tweaks tell Windows to treat your real-time game traffic 
like movement, aiming, or hit registration as higher priority than other network activity. It's especially useful in fast-paced titles like Valorant, CS2, Apex Legends, and Warzone. Tweak A. Maximize network responsiveness globally. How to. Press Win plus R. Type Regedit. Press Enter. If the MSMQ or parameters keys don't exist, right-click and create them manually. Inside parameters, right-click, New, DWORD 32-bit value, Name, TCP no delay, set value to 1. Name, disable bandwidth straddling, set value to 1. These force Windows message queuing, used indirectly by services and games, to bypass default TCP delays and prevent any sort of internal bandwidth shaping. Tweak B. Disable Nagel's algorithm per adapter. Stay in Regedit. You'll see several folders, long strings of characters. These are your network interfaces. To find the right one, open Command Prompt and run ipconfig. Match the IPv4 address, for example, 192.168.x.x, with the one listed under DHCP IP address in each registry folder. Once you've identified the right adapter, right-click in the right pane, new, DWORD 32-bit value, name, TCP ACK frequency, set value to 1, name, TCP no delay, set value to 1. These registry entries override default packet acknowledgement behavior. TCP ACK frequency reduces how often your system sends ACKs, or acknowledgement packets, decreasing delay. TCP no delay disables Nagel's algorithm, ensuring small packets, like keyboard presses or hit inputs, are sent immediately. Block background bandwidth stealers. Windows has sneaky auto bandwidth usage for updates and cloud sync. Disable delivery optimization. Settings, then Windows Update, then Advanced Options, then Delivery Optimization, then Turn Off, Allow Downloads from Other PCs, CMD Tweaks to Lower DNS and TCP Delay. Use these in Command Prompt, Admin, to clean and reduce latency. IP Config slash Flush DNS, NetShesh Int TCP Set global auto tuning level equals normal. Netshesh int TCP set global ECN capability equals disabled. Netshesh int TCP set global timestamps equals disabled. Run these after each reboot or automate via a startup script. Use a lightweight DNS such as Cloudflare or Google. A faster DNS means quicker game server connection and login. How to set? Control Panel, Network and Sharing Center, Adapter Settings, Right-click your connection, Properties, IPv4, Properties. Use the following DNS. Disable Xbox networking services. They can interfere with UDP traffic and background ports. Registry. Start equals 4. Optional CMD. Get App Package Xbox. Remove App Package. This can remove unnecessary background Xbox networking overlays. Force Windows to use default routing table. No VPN conflict. If you're using game VPNs or overlays, they might override DNS or routes. CMD fix, IP config slash release, IP config slash renew, then reapply DNS settings. This resets the routing table and fixes misroutes that add latency.
And that's how you prioritize game traffic in Windows using real QoS techniques, registry tricks, and smart networking. These tweaks, when combined, can seriously reduce ping, stop lag spikes, and make your multiplayer experience buttery smooth. Always test one change at a time and restart your PC after major tweaks. If this video helped you lower ping, let us know your results in the comments. Like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more cutting-edge gaming optimization guides. Zero fluff, just fast, smooth gameplay. See you next time.